Hit or miss. I guess they never miss, huh? What's up guys? So today I'm doing a Nicolol makeup tutorial. Um, I already primed and prepped and all that good stuff. So I'm just starting off with the Fenty Pro Filter Foundation in the shade 390. C390. Um, and I'm just stippling that all over my face with a stippling brush that I think is from e.l.f. Um, yeah, kind of straightforward. Um, now I'm taking the Fenty Beauty Concealer. Um, in the shade 370 um, I love this this is like super like paint esque um, so I'm gonna like let it dry a little bit um, before I go ahead and blend it out with a dampened beauty blender beauty sponge thing um, I'm sure that's like a random beauty sponge I highly doubt that it's like an official beauty blender but I'm gonna blend it out um, yeah <laughs> blending okay now that it's blended I'm literally gonna take that same foundation brush and just go over it a little bit um, under my eye so that it looks more natural because that concealer is a little light um, which is the point because I'm trying to like hide my under eye circles but going over again again makes it look like super natural like these are just my eyes it's just my skin my face you know um, I'm looking at the reference photo, so I'm confused. Um, I'm going to take the Sephora um, red carpet. It's actually an eyeshadow, um, but we're going to be using that as an eyeshadow and a blush today. Um, going off of the reference photo that's in the, the thumbnail. I keep wanting to say template, but it's definitely a thumbnail. Um, but I'm just starting by putting the blush or the eyeshadow on my nose. Um, I'm also starting to feel ridiculous at this point, but, you know, gotta do what I gotta do, um, cause I've already committed to this tutorial. <laughs> um, and then I'm starting to sort of build it out on my cheeks. Um, to be honest, I probably could have done a lot more, um, which you'll notice by the end of the tutorial. Um, but again, I was feeling ridiculous already. I'm guessing, like... The whole thing with this is to create like a, I mean, I know we're trying to look like an anime character, but like a blushing anime character, I guess, is the goal. I wonder, is this like hentai referencing? Like, is this hentai? I don't know. But I'm going to comb my eyebrows up and then I'm going to go in with our first product, which is the Glossier Bl Boy Brow. Ooh, Glossier Boy Brow in the color black. Um, I'm just going to brush that through my eyebrows um, just so that they're darker and it looks like I have more eyebrow, I guess. Um, pretty straightforward, I think, which boy brow is a really good product. I'm kind of mad because it's like $12 and it's like, damn, but it, it really do be hidden though. Um, after that, I'm going to scratch my face and then I'm going to take the Maybelline Expert Wear in Velvet Black. Um, and I'm just going to outline my eyebrows um, and also add like little front hairs to the front, front hairs to the front, um, because I don't really have that much hair there. Um, but, you know, you want to get your eyebrows like closer to the bridge of your nose or whatever. Um, so that's what we're doing <laughs> at this point. Um, I should have gone back in on the back tail, but I didn't. <laughs> So, <laughs> I didn't. Um, I'm continuing to look at the reference photo and be confused. And so we're going to take more blush. Um, now we're going to go ahead and put it on the eyes. Um, in the photo, it almost looks like she has like, like exhausted eyes, I guess is the best way to say it. Um, so I was just sort of trying to recreate that um, with the red. Um, I also ended up taking like a sparkly eyeshadow, like a sparkly brown um, that I didn't end up showing you guys, um, but it's not super necessary, um, but it's just like a light sparkly brown eyeshadow. Um, I think it was out of the Take Me Back to Brazil palette by BH Cosmetics, but I could be completely wrong. 
I'm gonna keep going with that same red um, and I'm gonna go under the eye now um, again creating that exhausted I don't even know what else to call it type of eye that she has going on in the photo um, I'm also gonna link the photo below in the description box so like if you want to have like a better look of what I'm talking about you can um, just because again this is a very particular makeup style um, let's not forget that I have a hangnail you guys what's that um, I'm gonna blend that out with some brush from when wild um, just so that it's not so like in the spot I guess Now I'm taking Urban Decay's um, Naked Bronzer in the color Lit, and I'm just putting that in my inner corners. Um, this is more so just something that I do with my makeup. Um, she definitely doesn't have this in the photo, but again, I do it because I like it and it makes me feel pretty. <laughs> and I'm going to continue to do that by going on my nose um, with that same Lit shade. You can tell in the picture that she has like highlight on her nose. Um, and then she also has like hell of red like at the bottom part of the nose um is that like the classic like blush on your nose type thing that people will be talking about on twitter i don't know but like i'm here for it but i'm also not maybe not in red um i'm gonna take the voluminous lash paradise from l'oreal in the color black waterproof um and i'm gonna go on my lower lash line um because in the photo you can tell she doesn't have on lashes but she definitely has very pronounced lashes. Um, so she probably has very long natural lashes. That, or she has a really good mascara because she clearly doesn't have on eyelash extensions either. Um, so we're going to try to recreate that as best as possible. Um, I also suck at putting on eyelashes. So this is like a win-win for me because I'm not expected to. I also only have this mascara <laughs> in quarantine. So that's tragic. Um, I'm going to go ahead and curl my upper lashes just so that they look longer and better when I actually go ahead and apply the mascara right about now. See? Y'all see how I did that? Because that's my business. See? And they're already looking delightful. Um, you do want to get them like really coated um, just because you can tell she has on like a lot because again, she's clearly trying to make it so her eyelashes are pronounced, but still natural looking because she clearly has an audience to appeal to, which I can respect, even though I'm sure it's like a weird audience of like men that be wiling out, but apparently they give her money. So that's cool. Always respect that. What next? Making faces, what next? Okay, now we're gonna contour. I'm using the e.l.f. cream contour palette that I got from Target. I'm gonna be using that um, lower brown shade, not the darkest one that's pan, but the other one. Um, and I'm just contouring underneath my cheekbone to make my cheekbone more pronounced. Um, I should have done some on my jaw as well, like my complete lower jaw, but it looks as though I did not do that. So that is unfortunate. Also looks like I should have put more foundation on my chin, but you know, hindsight is 2020 or whatever. I'm like, why am I making that face? <laughs> Going back in with that same damn red. Oh, okay. Now we're going to go ahead and make, make our lip color. So I'm taking the Glossier, 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 MangoBomb.com and I'm just like taking some of the red um, I was clearly having a hard time and making a mess like I got it all over my desk which is why I was frowning um, but I'm taking that red eyeshadow and I'm just mixing it into the balm in order to make like a red lip gloss type deal um, I bet you'll, you guys are like watching this and you're like didn't you say Glossier right the first time <laughs> like why did you struggle but it'd be like that it'd be like that here is our final look I'm trying to not stand in the shadow and I'm failing okay this is better um my final review of the Nico Lil makeup um I like it but I don't 
um i think mostly because like this is a lot of blush and then the red is a lot um but i do really like the whole like red on the lip like just a little bit type deal um and i do kind of like like maybe using a little more blush than i'm used to <laughs> um i think i will kind of incorporate that into my day-to-day -day, like makeup routine um just with like pink normal blush <laughs> um because clearly this is supposed to look like an anime character or um yeah an anime character and it's not suitable for real life but she has an audience to appeal to um but it's not that bad. It also wasn't that hard to do. <laughs> Subscribe! Okay, okay. Boomer. Whatever you say. Boomer. <laughs>